Hello, and that was the requested transcription I did of the Hamilton Bohannon song, Let's Start to Dance, and Fernando Saunders was the bass player on that track, and you can find this transcription at musento.com under Advanced Learning Songs, and also at Greg's Transcripts. And wow, thanks for this request, Greg. I think it's a great song for a, for a bass player to, uh, to learn. It's pretty challenging, and it, uh, it might take some time, but uh, I've got some tips that uh, uh, can hopefully help you out to learning this one. It took me about 17 hours over two weeks I can see in Musento and um, it, it, it is a challenge but uh, I like songs like this. You can, uh, I think you find uh, creative in different ways to, uh, to practice it, to try to learn it. And now the tips to do it, well the obvious things to, uh, to try to learn it is of course to play at a slower tempo and keep bringing it up but uh, with, with doing that you got to be careful that when you're playing at a slower tempo not to play it differently than what you're going to play it at a faster tempo. You have to remember the goal is always to play it at, uh, um, I think in this case it's around 120 beats per minute, but you know, if you, when you start playing it slow, you might start playing it differently and then you get to those higher tempos and all of a sudden you can't play it the same way and you kind of have to go back and relearn it again. So just keep in mind that when you're playing at the uh, slower tempos, to, to use the same fingering and, and try to get the same technique and, and sounds that you will uh, that you're striving for at the faster tempos. Something else you can do is just put on the click and just go through bar by bar and just loop each bar a couple times and go on and some bars you might uh, loop more than others but um, that's okay and again just adjust the tempo keep challenging yourself to to try to inch closer to your to your goal tempo. Another, another way that uh, I found myself doing, I think it's a great way, is you just keep adding one note. The beginning of the bar, and then you just keep adding one note. I, I think uh, classical p uh, piano players kind of do this technique, and it works really well. I mean, you really ingrain the rhythm and the, uh, and the technique and the muscle memory in, into your hands. And I think it's a great way to, to learn, especially a song like this with so many, so many rhythms. And uh, that's what I'm going to do for you now. I'm going to uh, demonstrate this adding one note at a time. I'm going to play too short and too long, and then I'm going to move on to the next note. And you'll see it. I've uh, drawn a little boxes around every time I, I move on. And then at the end, I'm going to play, do a bass, uh, bass drum play along, and uh, I'm just going to read it down from top to bottom, and that's going to be at 95 beats per minute. Okay, thanks for watching. We'll see you at the end.
Hamilton Bohannon, uh, Let's Start the Dance, and Fernando Saunders was the original bass player on that track. And you can find this transcription at musento.com under Advanced Learning Songs and at gregstranscripts.com. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the, uh, the website. And we'll see you again next time. Thanks. Bye-bye.